With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. Two bodies of mass M1 and M2 are initially at rest placed in finite distance apart. They are then allowed to move towards each other under mutual gravitational attraction. Show that their relative velocity at approach at separation r between them is infinite distance apart. Then their potential energy will be zero and kinetic energy will also be zero. Now when they are r distance apart then we can use conservation of energy then initial energy is zero is equal to minus potential energy when they are r distance apart plus half m v1 square plus half m v2 square. Now they are moving towards each other due to their mutual force of attraction. Mutual force of attraction. So this is an internal force and F external is zero on the system. Then we can conserve conserve linear momentum linear momentum so initially it is zero and when they are r distance apart they have got velocity v1 and v2 zero is equal to m1 v1 plus m2 v2 or v1 will be equal to m2 v2 upon m1 now this will be minus because they are moving in opposite directions. So we will take here the magnitude. Now putting in the value of the equation g m1 m2 upon r is equal to half m. We will put the value of this p1 square means m2 square v2 square upon m1 square plus half m2 v2 square. We will multiply it by 2 then 2g m1 m2 upon r will be equal to this will get cancelled then m2 square v2 square upon m1 plus m2 v2 square. Now 2g m1 m2 upon r will be equal to we will take m2 v2 square common then this will be equal to m2 upon m1 plus 1 that means and here m2 and m2 will get cancelled we get v2 to be equal to m1 under root 2g upon r m1 plus m2 and the same in the same way we will get v1 is equal to m2 under root 2g upon r m1 plus m2 now velocity of approach velocity of approach will be v1 plus v2 
that means m1 under root 2g upon r m1 plus m2 plus m2 under root 2g upon r m1 plus m2 now this will be m1 plus m2 into 2g upon r m1 plus m2 so finally this will come out to be say v approach will be under root 2g m1 plus m2 divided by r this will be the answer so answer this one is correct thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today